uh, just amazing for these kids, for the community. I mean, it's been a long time coming. Um, we've had some good teams over the years, but we've never got over the hump and, and got to this point. So I, had, I actually had some family members that were on the 82 team. So, I mean, it's just a great thing, though, for the community, for these kids, um, for my dad. My dad's just a baseball junkie, and he just it's, he's just living the dream right now. So I guess were there any in the journey to get here, were there any uh, key victories or, or I guess describe the journey to get to this? Because, you know, you've got a lot of, lot of opponents in, in the um, – Postseason. Yeah, I mean, at one point, about halfway through the year, we were eight and eight, and um, and these kids could have could have folded. They could have just said, you know what, it's not our year. But we ended up uh, that that week when we were eight and eight, we ended up getting three big wins and capped off on a Friday of that week. Um, our one of our aces threw a no hitter, so I think that right there just kind of got us going as a team. Um, and ever since then, we've reeled off eleven of thirteen, and obviously six straight games in the tournament to get to Columbus. You said you had a couple of big wins there. Was there any uh, victory in particular that stood out to you and to the team? Well, we had a we had a game in the regional semifinal with Macomb. Um, went all 10 innings. Um, West, West Perry pitched all 10. It was 0-0 going to the 10th, and we ended up getting three runs in the top of the 10th inning, and we ended up winning 3-0. But that was just a – I think that game right there, I think that just – they knew they could win, and then we played a tough Miller City team in the regional and ended up getting a 5-1 win, and it's just, they're just playing so well right now. They're playing loose. They're having fun. Like some of the kids say, they're, we're a family, and it's just all worked out so far. So tell me about going into uh, the championships here. Do you know anything about your, your opponents? Or? Yeah, they're a team from uh, basically over near Youngstown, Ohio, which is completely across the state, I mean directly east across the state. Uh, don't know a whole bunch about them other than the fact from the people I've talked to says they're kind of like us. I mean, they're they're not a, they're not going to wow you when they get off the bus. They're a, kind of a smaller team, but they're fast. They like to put the ball in play. They like to bunt. They have two. Obviously, to get to this point, you have to have good pitching. So they have good pitching. So it, it's just going to be fun. I, other than that, we don't really know. We're just going to we're just going to go down there tomorrow and uh, and have fun and play loose and see what goes. So what day and so it's tomorrow is the championship. Yeah, tomorrow night. Tomorrow night at seven o'clock. Seven o'clock in Hunterton Park. Hunting, Huntington Park. Okay, and that's around um, what the affiliate for Cleveland. That, the Indians Cleveland Indians Park. AAA. Yep. Um, I guess have there been any individuals? You said there was a, a gentleman that uh, was had done a no hitter. Um, are there individuals that have really stood out on this team to you? Yeah, it's. I mean, our our top of the lineup's been really good all year. Our pitching here down the stretch um, has just been phenomenal, especially in the tournament. I mean, we had a few games during the regular season that were, you know, we weren't getting out of them what we thought we could get out of them. But here, I mean, they've completely focused here in the tournament. And I, I couldn't reel off the numbers, but they're amazing, the numbers that these guys are, are putting up. And do you know if any of these uh, kids out here, do they have any relatives that are going to be, you know, helping to see them off that are from the 1982 team? Um, Actually, two of two of the kids that are on this team, their dads played on the last state championship team in 1978. So, and an uncle of one of the players played on the 82 team. My, I actually had a brother that was on the 82 team, and then my other brother was on the 78 state championship team. So, I never got there as a player, but we're there as a as a coach. And I'm telling you right now, it's just an amazing feeling.